Hello everyone, welcome to Manupatra Daily News Podcast. Here are some highlights for 7th November 2022. Starting with Supreme Court, Supreme Court has by 4 ratio 1 majority upheld the validity of the 103rd Constitutional Amendment which introduced 10% reservation for the economically weaker sections in education and public employment. Supreme Court while granting relief to several persons who were displaced by land acquisition by Mahanadi Coal Fields Limited in 1988 has held that Land Acquisition Rehabilitation and Resettlement Act 2013 will apply to the person in four villages whose lands were acquired for coal fields. Supreme Court while issuing direction for payment of compensation to families of victims and for revival of criminal cases which are lying dormant stated that there was failure on part of state to maintain law and order and to protect rights of people guaranteed under article 21 of constitution delhi court while observing that the remark f off is a vulgar american slang and is not used in indian society schools or colleges to ask anyone to leave has held it is sexually colored remark which is offensive abusive and humiliating The Kakaduma Court Delhi has framed charges against former Aam Aadmi Party councillor Tahir Hussain and seven other men in the case alleging that a Khajuri Khas resident Ajay Goswami was hit by a bullet during the 2020 North East Delhi riots. Delhi High Court has held that arbitration clause Delhi High Court has held that arbitration clause would not lose its character merely because the word meditation has been used as its nomenclature and in construction of the contractual clause court should be guided by substance of agreement rather than by the nomenclature The JNK and Ladakh High Court has held that the performance of an employee or an officer in an organization is a primarily matter between the employee and the employer and falls within the meaning of personal information and therefore exempted under section 81j rti act thank you everyone